Well, someone is still fast asleep, so off to get some coffee. It is 20 to 8, pretty much. Yep. Last morning, last full, not last full day, last day. The last full day was yesterday, but the flight isn't until I think it's 9 or 10 p.m. tonight, so we've still got a long time to go. New favorite coffee, although it's tricky to get, is the white chocolate macadamia nut. Uh, it's like a cold brew with a cream. Very naughty, but very delicious, of course. Anyway, it'll be filter coffees. This place opens at 6 a.m., so pretty handy. And it's just between the shops of Mandalay and Luxor. Coffee has been sourced. Just now need to go and find some breakfast pastries. I'm gonna have a look in the Citizen, I think it's called or something. Kind of just where all the restaurants are, because not had a look yet and they might have some nice stuff. Okay, let's try somewhere else. So Citizens had like, um, kind of, it said to go, it's like little pizzas. There was a croissant and a panic club, but they didn't look the best. So just checking if there's something hidden here. So after walking about 10 miles, this is a food court, it's just not open. So for the future, you've got the pizza one, which you see in a lot of places. You've got a Johnny Rockets, Nathan's, Pan Asian, and a Subway. And it's right next to the ticket um, kiosk for the Shark Reef Aquarium. Oh, let me show you that nice coffee. Hang on, it's closed, so that's not why. So under the yes is more, that left hand one white chocolate macadamia cream cold brew uh, tim had one we got it in cosmopolitan i think it was really nice everywhere else has been sold out morning morning coffee run last day five percent dinom 375 bed i'm still half asleep oh i just saw the major go past Come on, let's get something. Let's get some work. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, come on, you wanna give me the major? Major! One more, last spin. Best of luck on this coffee run, but two or three spins in, I've just got the warm feature, the feel sorry for you, where it gives you it. I mean, I don't want the mini, but I think at this point, I'll take anything. Oh, it's gonna be the mini. 10 cents, so at least 100 bucks. Uh, good morning on our final day here in Las Vegas and it has gone surprisingly fast. We've done lots we wanted to, we've not done some stuff we wanted to, uh, even though we feel okay now, the, that uh, first day travel really did knock us for a couple of days, it took us a while to get our heads around it all, but we're just going around for a final coffee run see what we get before we go to the pool for a couple of hours. I don't think we've got any real plans today. Uh, last night was great fun at the Atomic Saloon. I think I'll put some clips on the last vlog at the end, hopefully without giving too much away, but just a, a little bit of a, a teaser. I've got a feeling it's not going to last long. And for the size of the, uh, 
uh, um, the seating area. It was not sold out, but then again, it is midweek and it was the earlier show. Um, but yeah, let's enjoy this last day, do what we can do, and hopefully get that elusive hand pay. Because we've, <laughs> the time we've been here and the money we put through, I thought we'd have had one by now, but there we go. The luck hasn't been there this, uh, this entire week. Oh, and I'm being followed <laughs> by a man in yellow, which we all know that means security. But uh, yeah, we get anything on the floor, we'll let you know. There he goes. Uh, we actually decided to come back to the beach because there are far fewer people here than yesterday and the Delano one was actually quite busy so but the pool isn't open yet but we will I think we're pretty much on the same place we were yesterday as well that's the red that's the messy chair yeah. we spent the morning doing the coffee run which was just as bad as the first day no luck spent some time by the pool which is really nice today the Delano Beach Club was open we went in, it was very busy, so we went back out, back to the beach, which was very quiet, because we realized no one was allowed in the pool. I don't know, maybe a shark swam up, I don't know. Things happen in Vegas, crazier things happen. We had to wait about an hour and a half, cooking like rotisserie chickens, until we were allowed in the water. They must have found the shark. And then we spent the next hour bobbing around before coming up packing the bags and getting ready to go back out. We're gonna to go to Noodles at Bellagio, somewhere we've wanted to go for a while. Um, a subscriber we bumped into at the beginning of our trip also recommended it, so we're gonna go give it a go. And then kind of slowly crawl back through MGM territory. Matthew's just doing the last of the packing. I get to avoid it when I do these. <laughs> Um, hopefully our plane isn't cancelled. Well, I don't mind if it's actually cancelled going that way, but... Um, but yeah, we'll catch up with you. Whatever we are, it's, we're going to monorail it from here to Excalibur, and then monorail it from Park to Bellagio. Alright, so we're in Bellagio looking for noodles. We don't know where it is. We can remember we didn't actually uh, check the conservatory out early morning like we hoped we would. So here we are. Koi fish. Yeah. Oh, it's lovely, okay? See if I can zoom in on the old fishy wish. So this is going to be a kind of halfway sign off for the video, even though it's not the end yet. Completely forgot to actually do one on the main video because we were in the airport at the time uh, and, and boarding. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, I also wanted to say and just give you a heads up. This is this last video is a bit thrown together, a bit mis mishmash of the stuff we did manage to record, uh, but thought it's still worth putting it in just to close the whole series off. So thank you so much for following us along on this trip. Um, if you liked the series, please make sure you give a thumbs up and subscribe to see our future stuff. We have another Vegas trip coming up, not for a while, uh, but in the summer 25. And we're also delving into other things, including the world of Disney, which we uh, have got three trips lined up for. Uh, one this year in Paris, then two, two in Orlando next year. So make sure you subscribe if you want to follow us along on those trips. But for now, at least, 
Thank you for watching and we'll see you in our next vlogs. Bye for now. So that was noodles. No, that was noodles. That's baccarat and that's man. Very good. Four dishes, more than enough. More, whoop, four dishes, more than enough. Oh, two starters. Yep, two appetizers, two mains. How much was it? 90 something. 90 something dollars. So yeah, recommend that. That was nice. Glad we did that. And good quick. Stay, yeah, good quick, well priced. Nothing fancy, just good noodles. Right, we're gonna carry on, have a walk around in here, and then make our way slowly back down to Delano. We've got four hours until we wanna leave. So just killing time now. So just walking through Aria now. I just noticed they've changed their um, atrium decoration. I don't think it's finished. Because when we came through here yesterday, half of these were up, so I'm not sure what else is to go. But by the time you watch this vlog, it's gonna be nearly October, I think, or probably nearly Halloween, so it may be changed again. <laughs> just a reminder, it's August the 21st. In we go. Right, uh, in Aria. Bit of low rolling, three games on the big one. No special drums, normal one, but let's 188 a bit. Uh, nope, that's nothing, is it? God damn. Oh, re trigger. Re trigger with just some boats. So, at least we're on six now. So, let's get the third game in. Nope. Oh no, sorry, some um, coins. Oh, come on, let's do... Let's send us home with buckets of cash. Oh, another re-trigger. Uh, I'm hoping it's not going to do the re-triggers with the little tiny wins. Let's still get some good ones in there. Uh, nope. No. Oh, go on. Oh, a little something. Okay. That's a hundred in, so oh and another re trigger. Well generous on the odd re triggers, but let's get some more big coin coin J wins. Uh nope. Come on, yes, yes. Yep, that should be good. Ninety nine, and let's do that again. No, tens. Two more games. Come on, yes, 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 doggos. Oh, that's the connecting doggo. Right, last game. Um, not much. But you know what? Happy with that. The way it's been going today, Mandalay Bay, Stephanie had been terrible luck. So we had to get out of there. Back up.
Right, hang on, get comfy. Made it over to Park MGM. Got our slow trudge back. Uh, just got quad trigger on high limit, but not really high limit. Five cent denom, five dollar bed. Let's see what we can get. Let's get a screen full of diamonds. So no blockers at the front. Mm, last game. Bearing in mind $75 of this, what's the trigger? Oh well. Back up. Up in the stakes, 12.50 spin bonus. Let's hope this is slightly better than the other one. Let's go. Oh, that's uh, decanting our final drinks. Right, well, let's get the holding spin on this one. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Two more games, don't do this. Last game. Well, that sums up this fucking trip. Fuck you. So, out of Park MGM, Lala Noodles reopens today. I don't know if we told you, but we really wanted to eat them every day. The day we got here, it closed for like a refurbishment, deep clean. And now we're leaving. It's opening in 20 minutes. That's the New York sign, still undergoing its refurb. The gods of gambling are looking down on us this trip. They give us a little tease now and then with a nice win, but they otherwise they take. They take it all. I'm still not over that 12.50 bonus on Lightning Link. Not over it. But I'm continuing to drink and that makes everything better. Apparently so. Next stop on the way back, New York. We've got a Tom's Urban again, so we might get those four pints for $16. Okay, New York, New York, and got a 485 jackpot on whatever this game is. New York. That's not you. Triple jackpot 3x jewels. I knew that was, I could tell that was high. It's nearly as high as that one. It was, it was higher than that one actually. Uh, yes. Jackpot pays 485. So yeah, it was higher than the one above it. Right, so we're now in Excalibur and I got the price wrong. So the urban beers, these things here, are 16 ounce, not $16. So the two for one Tom's Urban takeaway works at about 21 70 something for four 16 ounces essentially. So I've got two mango cart, Matt's got two Modelo. On the way back in Excalibur, we have stopped at Tap again for another voucher from My Vegas. $25 off, spent off 50. Yeah. For the final meal, yeah, of course, for the final meal in Vegas at Tap in Excalibur. I've gone for the chicken tendies in Buffalo with chips, giant pretzel, and Matt's gone for the wings. Exactly the same with buffalo, I just didn't want to pick the food up. And then some ranch side on the sauce. Oh, oh perfect, thank you so much. Thank you. thank you. So there we go. Final meal, Matt. Mm. Mm. All right, so we just did the TSA approved thing and it was super quick and our flight is, this is Timothy. Our flight is there, so 
boo to be going home, but yay to be going home. Um, 9.40, so 9.47. We were tracking the inbound flight. Wasn't really that much delayed, so I think we'll be fine. Right. And we've just done our first TSA pre-check and that took 20 seconds from entering security to coming out. That was a yeah. breeze. It's like normal, you know, you, as in, for like Europe, like you just like leave, it. yeah, you leave it all go through, which is good. So sunset in Las Vegas. Uh, it was just setting over the mountains, which is always a really nice view. We're facing the wrong way this way. Um, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see. No. Uh, maybe a little bit. That's the Red Rock Canyon that way and planes landing that way. That's the way towards the Nelson uh, ghost town. So it's that direction. Anyway, that was very quick.